Hello everyone, I'm Alan, also known as McLaren2009, and today I'm back playing Derail Valley. But instead of a live stream, today I'm going to do a shorter video while I figure out how to set up distributed power. It's part of this new Build 99 update, and it comes down to the uh, customization things you can buy for your locomotives. So, I have four engines set up. Two DE6s, a DH4, and a slug. So, in order to make this all possible, you go in here into the cab. I've added a couple of things to each of the DE6s, but the focus of what I'm trying to do today is all coming down to this. This box right here. is going to control the distributed power. Now, I have a train that I'm working on putting together, and I have one of these boxes in both DE6s. So normally when I play this game, I have these four units all connected, but because I want to see how this system works, I'm going to split them apart. And I have three cuts of cars all going to the steel mill. So, we're going to use the front two engines with the help of the remote control to put the train together. Then we're going to pull it in the clear of this, or the main track and take it out. But, for starters, we need to tie the brakes on both of these engines. It actually didn't mess anything up. Now, since both of these are... Well, that doesn't even have a cutout cock, but it's not important. The DE6 is cut out, so we can dump this and nothing's going to change. I think. Alright. Okay, we've got the train back together. <clears throat> now for the interesting part. We're going to figure out how to set up distributed power. On a real locomotive, you start with the DP and work your way up. So, that's what we're going to do. Alright, cut that back out. Because we no longer need this to control the locomotive, or no longer need this to control the train. Alright, that's off. Let's put it on seven, why not? Everything's secured back here. Alright, let's go up front. Transmit... Seven front Okay, it's actually working.
so the thing that we had to do, I had to cut this one in. So this one's controlling the brakes. So the DH4's cut out. And because I'm using the uh, DP remote, I can't use the uh, handheld remote. So, as a bit of a recap of what all I just did, I set up both consoles on both ends. This one's set to transmit. I picked the random channel of seven. It's facing forward, so transmit, forward, channel seven. You go back to the rear end and you have receive, reverse, also seven, connected. You look over here at the control stand. Both automatic and independent are applied. I need to go back up and revert and change the reverser, but for the most part, we now have distributed power functioning on our train. That is me figuring out how to use distributed power in Derail Valley. Thank you all for watching, and hopefully you have a nice day.